Welcome to My Secret Math Tutor. In this example, I'm going to show you how to make a cumulative frequency chart. Now, what this type of chart will keep track of is our cumulative frequency. Think of that as our grand total. So, the data I will be using represents the age of a toddler and their weight gain every single year in pounds. So, if I'm going to make a chart that keeps track of the grand total, I'm going to add a new column to this chart that is basically the total weight. Alright, let's see how this works. So it looks like when the toddler was first born, they weighed 4 pounds. So right now our grand total is at 4. At age 1, they had gained 9 pounds. Well, since they started at 4 and they had gained 9, now we are up to 13 pounds for our total. Alright, let's continue. By age 2, they had gained another 2 pounds, and since they were at 13 last year, our total is now up to 15. So notice how we're taking these weight gains and basically adding them into our total every single year. So the next year, when we get, have another 2 pounds, this will jump up to 17, and then 20, 24, and looks like by age 6, they were all the way up to 27 pounds. All right. Now let's take this information and start to make our chart. Along the bottom of this chart, I will keep track of all the years. Okay. Now along the vertical axis, I'm going to keep track of the total weight. Alright, looks pretty good. Let's go ahead and start plotting out our data. So at age 0, they had a weight of 4. Age 1, looks like we're up here at 13. 2, we made it to 15. 3, we are at 17. 4, we made it to 20. 5, we are up at 24. And at age 6, looks like we are all the way up at age 27. Oops. Alright, so what this type of chart is really good for is showing us between what years the change was the greatest. These are going to be the steeper parts of the graph. So you can see that between age 0 and age 1, this is where it was the steepest, and sure enough, this is where we had the most weight gain. If you'd like to see some more videos, please visit MySecretMathTutor.com.